everyone, my name is Hannah and today's workout is an upper body extravaganza. So this is perfect for anybody with a lower body injury, anybody in a wheelchair, anybody that just wants some low impact workout that's gonna you know, get the heart rate up and going. So every exercise today is 40 seconds long. You're gonna need a chair or I'm on a bench. You can be in a wheelchair preferably something with no back on. So if you are in a wheelchair, you can just take the back down and make sure your foot rests are off or just push to the side. If you don't have a chair with no back on, don't worry, you can still do this. So make sure you have warmed up before you do this. And if you want some water, make sure it's nearby. And our first exercise is a chair runner. So you're gonna reach out, squeeze your knee in, reach out, squeeze it in. Okay, so off we go. So, you move as quickly as you can. If you can't move your leg, you're just gonna use your arms. So I'm really reaching over and squeezing in. Now, with the leg and the arm, really take up space, reach out. So you're working on the diagonal, squeezing in. Okay, good. 15 seconds. So this workout's gonna get your heart rate up. We're also gonna be working the abdominals, the arms, so we've got some body weight resistance moves. Three, two, one. Okay, come to center. We've got a 20 second rest. So our next one is gonna be a V-sit. So you're gonna sit out, bring your knees in, out, in. If you can't move your legs, you're just gonna do the, the upper body movement. So we are off in five, three, Two, one. Okay, so you're gonna come out, bring your legs up, out, up. I just need to position myself so a little bit further forward. There we go. So really crunching your knees up, out. So your hands, they can be at your head if you like. I prefer them out to my side. Remember, if you can't use your legs, you're just gonna use your upper body. Okay, so yes, make sure your bum is pushed to the front. So mine keeps sliding backwards. I need to keep repositioning myself. Five seconds. Keep breathing. Okay, our next one. So the last one of each group is cardio kickboxing. So we have two back hand uppercuts, jab cross. Two back hands, jab cross. So we're all on the same side. Five. Three, two, one. Okay, so come under, jab cross. So uppercut, uppercut, jab cross. Now put your hand in front of you to really punch up into. So you're coming from underneath to up. So low impact cardio exercises. As you can hear, it's got my heart rate up. Good, keep it going. So you just need to remember which side you are on. Move as quickly as you can. Five seconds. Okay, so we're going back to that first one. So we're gonna do a runner to the other side. So either with the leg and the arms, just the arms, or both together. 10 seconds. So have a deep breath in. Five, four, three, get ready to go. Here we are. So really crunch in, reach up. So take up space. You're on the diagonal. So around it doesn't matter if you can just use your upper body. Let's bring it in, really be strong. So crunch it in. 15 seconds. So we've got a new ab exercise coming up next. Five, three. Okay, come to center. Fingertips are gonna come up to your temples. We're gonna lean out to the side, center, out to the side, center. So imagine you're trapped between two planes of glass. So your body stays upright. Deep breath again, three seconds. We go. So really leaning out. 
So working the side body, getting a little bit of obliques. If you want a little bit more, lean further back. It's gonna engage the abdominal, abdominals. Keep breathing. Keep your arms nice and high. So the further you lean back, the more you're gonna feel it, but don't round your back. So nice and tall, push out through your chest. Okay, so now we're gonna go the other side with the uppercut, uppercut, jab, cross. So one, two, jab, cross. Your jab hand is always the one that your leg would be in front of. So I'm kind of positioning myself as with one leg slightly in front. Okay, off we go. Jab, so uppercut, uppercut, jab, cross. Uppercut, uppercut, jab, cross. So with all of these, move as quickly as you can. Our 40 seconds is just a guide. So it's 40 seconds of your hard work, but if you need to work for a few seconds, have a quick rest, then come back in, you do that. So keep it going. Be strong. So remember, we're going from down to up with that uppercut. Five seconds. Okay, so our last round here. So we're gonna change halfway through with the runners. So we're gonna go one side, I'll tell you to change to the other. Okay, 10 seconds. So we're gonna go through this group once more, then we get a little rest. Three, two, one, we go. So really squeezing it in. Now you've got this move, try and pick up the pace. And it's like you're reaching up and grabbing something to pull in. Okay, five more seconds and we're switching. Okay, over to the other side. So remember, really reach out, take up space. 10 seconds, five. Okay, new ab exercises is really gonna light a fire in your belly. We're gonna do a figure eight, so you're gonna lift your legs up. It's like you're passing something between your legs. Now, if you can't move your legs, you're gonna go to our first one, so that's sit up. Okay, three, two, one, off we go. So, legs. Now, the further your upper body leans back, the harder this is gonna be. You can always extend your legs straight rather than dropping them down. So, you pick your level. Remember, we could just be here. So, leaning back, coming up. Tapping to down to floor or extending out. And you're making an eight shape through your legs. So it's like I'm passing something back and forth. Don't round through the back. Ooh, three seconds. Okay, come down. So again with this one, we're gonna change halfway through. So two uppercuts, jab, cross. Two uppercuts, jab, cross. Okay, let's get ready to go. Five seconds. So hands out in front to protect us. Off we go. One, two, jab, cross. One, two, jab, cross. So you've got it. Let's pick up the pace a little bit. Okay, five seconds, then we're switching. Okay, switch. So this side, so a little bit of a workout for your brain here. Ten seconds, as I promised. Longer rest after this one. Five. Last one, and rest. So grab a drink now if you want one. It's gonna have a breather. Whew. So as I promised, it's gonna get your heart rate up. I am sweating. So this workout is for everyone. So I am a wheelchair user sometimes. So this is great for me when I need to be seated. 
I also had a pretty bad ankle injury that I had to have reconstruction for last year. So a lot of these moons are made from things that I had to do to keep my fitness up. Okay, 30 seconds. We've got a new exercise now. So these are all new. So a chair jack. So you're gonna reach out, like you're kicking out to a cross and up. So remember, you can just move your arms if you need to. 15 seconds. And with all of these, the further you lean back, the more work through your core you're gonna get. Okay, make sure your bum is kind of pushed up to the end. Three, two, one, off we go. So tap down, reach up. Whew. So my hamstrings are super tight, <laughs> so it's hard to kick my legs up. So remember, you can just be here, moving as quickly as you can go. 20 seconds. Kick it up, come on. 15. 10. Ooh, it's hard to get my legs up now. <laughs> One of them is like, no. Five. Three. So now we have my favorite upper body moves with no weights. So you're going to come to bring your arms together, elbows squeezing in, we're going to go shoulder to nose. Okay, three, two, one, off we go, shoulder to nose. Now if you can't get your elbows together, that's fine, just squeeze, so imagine there's something between them, squeeze it. So shoulder to nose. Ooh. So this one builds. You'll look at it and think, this is so easy. So it's great at targeting that area around your armpit. So good, really squeeze. So imagine you're holding a 50 pound note over a cliff and you're not gonna let it go. 10 seconds, come on. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Five, three, two, one, rest, shake your arms out. Okay, we're doing, just doing jab cross. So jab cross as quickly as you can go. 10 seconds, I'm gener feeling generous that I gave us a 20 second break between this. So I was like, oh, but I was like, actually we need it. Three, two, one, off we go. So jab cross as quickly as you can go. So keep your hands nice and high. If we were really boxing, they would be there to protect your face. But we're just doing it for that little bit of extra shoulder work. So come on, strong upper body. 20 seconds. Whew. Good, you've got this. 10. Keep breathing. Five. Three, two, one. Okay, rest, come back to center. So we're back to that chair jack. See how quickly my legs fail me on this one now. <laughs> so bum, push it right up to the end of your chair. Five seconds. Three, two, one, we go. So the further you lean your upper body back, the more you're gonna feel it. Like I said, at the start, if you don't have a chair, a backless chair, you can still do these, you just won't be able to lean as far back. 20 seconds, come on. 15. It's going, it's like, no, I can't get high. <laughs> Five. Okay, our next one here, we're going to be doing back behind, so I'm just going to swivel around so you can see my back. So palms face down, flip them over and squeeze the elbows back. Okay, I'm just going to come back around so you can see me. Off we go. So, hands really strong, first they start out towards the floor, flip them and squeeze your elbows back. So it's like you're trying to crack something between your shoulder blades, like a walnut. Good. 
Now make sure the elbows are coming back, not just to your side. So this one you could easily cheat me on, but just know if you can't feel it, you're only cheating yourself. Come on, let's keep it fast. Five. Okay, jab cross again. So we're gonna lead with the other hand. I just moved my feet because it's always like a reminder of which hand is my jab hand. So hands nice and high. Roll those shoulders back. Five, three, two, one, off we go. So jab cross. Now if you listen to boxers, they breathe out as they punch, so. So try that. It's all to do with power transferal. That most of us find when we start boxing, we get out of breath because we forget to breathe. So come on. Strong arms. 15 seconds. Let's go, 10. Pick up the pace a little bit. Five, three, two, one, relax. So this is our last round. So you've got it, we've got the strength. My palms are sweaty. 10 seconds to go. So chair jacks is where we're starting. So out and in. Three, two, one, off we go. So just a reminder, you could just be here, reaching up quickly. If you're with me, you can pray for us in this last one. 30 seconds, come on. This one is a toughie. Ooh. See, that, that leg's doing it again, come on. 15 seconds. 10, we know you're there, come on. Don't fall off your chair. Three. And rest. Okay, our last one here. Elbows are kind of come up. Hands towards your chest, so just about shoulder height. You're going to push out. So out with the heel of the palm. Okay, again, roll the shoulders back. Sit up nice and tall, bring your hands up. Off we go. So you're pushing out. Try and keep your elbows nice and high. Ears stay away from the shoulders, so the temptation here is gonna to be to really hunch up. Don't do it, relax through the neck. Push out, come on. So we're targeting the backs of the arms here. Push away. 15 seconds. Elbows, check them, are they high? Mine are dropping, come on, 10 seconds. We've only got one more move after this. Five. And rest. Okay, so jab cross. So we are just gonna come to center for this last one. 40 seconds, that is it. That is all that's left between us and finishing this. So you've got it. Five, so roll the shoulder, sit up nice and tall. Deep breath in. Off we go, come on. 40 seconds. What is that out of your day now? Nothing, come on. Nice and strong. Breathe. Sit, stay with me. Twenty. Fifteen. Sit, pick up the pace, come on, last ten, we've got it. Five, three, two, one. Relax. Good job, everyone. If you're working out with someone, you can give them a high five. If you're alone like me, I'm high fiving you. Good job. So, make sure you have a cool down after this. Hydrate lots. And I hope to see you again soon. Goodbye.